Yeah, so if you're watching this, it's obviously not a digital camera. It's a uh, digital camcorder. Um, so I'm coming up with these people. Let's see if, uh, see if they notice what I'm doing. Da, 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 da. So I'm with the camera. Yeah, this is really weird. I don't know if I could just talk to myself all the time. I'll probably get used to it though. So, yeah, I just went to the mall. My batteries actually died. <laughs> That's why this uh, the weather's changed uh, in a second. So, yeah, just walking home now. And uh, what was I talking about? I don't know. I'm sorry if I'm complaining about my life at times. It's kind of what vloggers do. But actually, I'm really a lot of fun. Uh, a lot of fun. I hope this isn't too windy. start filming this for like a couple minutes a day. Just uh, get and tell all if you're part of my family, um, please share the link to this place, my channel. Um, you know, whatnot. I got for all you non-family members, I have 22 cousins and like 10 aunts and uncles both sides together combined so people just like look at me and then like they don't make a face at all they just kind of you know sometimes when I do weird things in public <laughs> just often um, people don't really know how to react so they just kind of keep it all bottled inside which is weird you know because it's definitely not what I do at all maybe that's the only reason why I think it's weird maybe it's not that weird um, like one day last Halloween I dressed up as the Joker but in his nurse costume, if you guys seen The Dark Knight. Um, so I think I pulled it off pretty good and I had a wig. Whoa! <laughs> and, uh, and I was, I was just walking around. <laughs> and it was the day before Halloween, which probably explains it. But people would look at me and then they would just, you know, like nothing was wrong. You know, like they would just like look at me and then be like, mm -hmm. But then there were other people that actually like screamed or, you know, people were saying like Joker quotes. Um, often, but I was really, I was really let down by how apathetic some people are about funny things that happen, because I, I actually laugh probably more than I talk, probably not, but a lot, <laughs> I laugh at a lot of things, and <laughs> someone's looking at me, where is she, I don't know, she thinks I'm just like posing for a picture or something, but yeah, so, yeah, it kind of bothers me sometimes. When, you know, people see funny things or weird things, and they're so indifferent, you know? And I hope that, you know, I hope a lot of people aren't like that when, you know, some kind of emergency happens. But, you know what they actually are? <laughs> I, was doing, uh, I was doing CPR training, and uh, the instructor told me, in 10 years of being on the ambulance whatever force, um, she has never come to a site where someone was doing CPR on somebody else. Like, like a, a first aid trained person, like people get trained in it because it's part of your job. Like you gotta, you gotta have training and first aid and stuff. But nobody, nobody uses it when it, got, you know, when it comes time for, for an emergency. That's really weird. That's really weird to me. Um, I don't know, sometimes like, I've been in situations where, you know, time really mattered and I had to do something for someone. And, uh, you know, I'm not, Definitely not afraid. Definitely not. And I shouldn't be if I'm aspiring to be a doctor. <laughs> Which uh, is another part of this uh, this reason. I gotta keep checking that this thing is actually on. Which is another reason uh, why I'm doing this this whole vlog thing. Um, possibly it might help my chances in the interview process. Because uh, part of part of going to med school is you have to have really good social skills. Like they don't want um, a doctor who can't talk to people and can't relate to people and stuff. So I'm thinking maybe if I get a big following or something, who knows? I don't know. It'll demonstrate I got some social skills, and maybe they'll watch them and hear what I have to say. And uh, you know, <laughs> I'm just gonna walk right through here. This guy's just chilling. So. 
going to be doing that. And uh, um, I don't know, that's going to be a pretty big journey, a pretty big part of my life for uh, So, <laughs> um, yeah, I'll, I'll definitely do a week on that, on just, like, all the stuff I have to do for med school, which I'm not even going to be going to for another, like, three years, and, uh, I'll definitely do a week on that, but obviously there's going to be tidbits of topics every video, and, uh, so, ooh, it's cold, ooh, ooh. and, uh, yeah, so... 20 years old now, and I kind of feel no different, actually. It's just kind of a number, but I feel like I gotta start referring to professors by their first names now. Not just because of my birthday, but this, is, this has been kind of going on for a while. Um, yeah, because I've always been so respectful of professors and stuff. Like, as soon as you have a master's degree, you're automatically really cool in my books. I can't explain it. I'm not... I don't look down on people who don't have, you know, like, university education or whatever, but, like, it just boggles my mind how much schooling some of these guys went through. And, and they're done, and they're professors. <laughs> Check that it's on. And, uh, it's just intense. It's just really intense, and I, I got a lot of respect for hardworking people. Uh, especially when it comes to school. So I've been, I've been doing pretty good in school most of my life. So yeah, coming back to my house. This is it. I called it Brown Town. So of all the big brown houses, not for any other reason. Um, <laughs> probably gonna have to edit that out. Okay. Well, I'm getting back inside. And I think this pretty much wraps up the video. This is like, how many minutes is this video going to be? Like 17 minutes? I don't know. Go on. Yeah, I got to close the door. I never, I never close this door. <laughs> and they kind of get mad at me. David. So, David's eating corn. It's good for the bowels. Is it? I don't know. I'll figure it out. But yeah, back home. So, keep watching this video. Ooh, I disappeared. And, uh, and send it to all your friends, uh, hit the big yellow subscribe button, and there's lots more to come. So, I'm Jonas Vasquez, until next time.